As a veterinarian, it's very disappointing to me to see that I'm not making a huge difference in a lot of animals. And with 46% of dogs getting cancer and 39% of cats getting cancer, as a small animal practitioner, I feel often that I'm, there are things that we're doing that are not good enough. And there's so much information that I don't know. And the more you keep searching and the more you keep your mind open and say, well, why not try oxygen? When you have inflammation, when you have swelling, when you have bruising, when you have trauma, when you have any kind of an infection or even cancer, you have higher amounts of carbon dioxide that build up in the tissue. And if there's some way to bring down that inflammation of the carbon dioxide, and you can bring down the inflammation, bring down the pain, start the healing cascade, encourage mitochondria to start functioning more efficiently inside the cell, you can actually have cells start to heal. And what is the most important nutrient that you need to give to cells is oxygen.